Hi, everyone. My name is Matt Haynes. I'm an audiobook narrator, and this is part of my series of self-improvement paths. I like to start each week with a certain mantra or a specific practice that makes moving forward in my work and in my life a little bit easier and a little bit more fun. Uh, the examples I'll be giving are from my work as a narrator and a teacher of narration. Uh, but I think that uh, these practices are things that can be applied usefully to just about any area of your life that you want to improve. Give it a try. If you have any trouble, let me know. So this week's focus as we go along our path, keep the list, the wish list, the wish list as you go along. Okay, what's the wish list? I'm finding that as I'm anticipating each next day, uh, that I tend to get a sense of vagueness, of dread. Uh, it's just, you know, there's a sense of responsibility, of impending responsibility, and just wondering, okay, well, what's going to be fun about this? What's going to be successful about this? Because my mind gets worked up. It's like, well, I could fail at this, this, this. Well, okay. So what I actually do each night before going to bed lately is I make a list of all the different things, all the different fails that I don't want to have happen. And then I reverse that list into the different successes that I want to have happen, um, either getting out of the way so that they do happen, maybe being a little proactive so that they do happen, but not trying to push, not trying to force, just allowing the positive things to come in. So uh, let's say, uh, okay, tomorrow I really don't want my throat to go raw while I'm narrating. Okay, so what do I want? I want my throat kept warm and loose. Okay, that plants a little seed in my mind. Uh, perhaps uh, the next day as I check, by the way, I recommend checking this wish list on the hour. Um, as I check the list, okay, throat warm and loose. Well, there are things I can do. I can have warm water when i uh when i'm recording i can get myself a little massage every now and again when i'm recording i can recognize when my throat is getting raw and i can take a break yes okay so throat kept warm and loose then maybe another one is i don't want to be distracted with other thoughts while i'm narrating okay so we flip that to the positive of the wish list fun self challenges to engage me at all times so then I'm focusing on, oh, okay, well, uh, my mind drifted just a little bit. I'm going to focus on this to keep myself engaged. These things are there. They're waiting for me. Now, students, what are some things that I find with uh, students that sometimes are uh, difficult uh, for them? Uh, having trouble getting started. Okay, so let's say that that's one of your uh, negatives that you don't want to have happen the next day. Okay, well, then the reverse is starting with no trouble. Having that being the focus in and of itself sometimes will help you get out of your head about, okay, well, the reason I'm having trouble getting started is because I don't know if this, this, this. No, no, the whole point is to start with no trouble. Okay, I'm starting. Uh, another thing that sometimes uh, my students work with is forgetting to breathe. I, I suffer from this too. Oh, so what is the uh, solution? remembering to breathe. So when you forget to breathe, don't get down on yourself. Just remember, oh yeah, I have so many opportunities to remember to breathe. And uh, because I know that I forgot, I now remember. <sighs> so keep your wish list, make your wish list, keep your wish list with you as you go. That's what I'll be focusing on this week. I'll get back to you with my results. You get back to me with yours. Thank you for joining me. And as your narrator and teacher of narration, I hope that our paths cross again real soon.